क्लास नाइन एंड टेन स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम बैक टू विमल सर्जी यूट्यूब चैनल राधे राधे जय श्री कृष्ण दिस इज क्वेश्चन नंबर इलेवेन डी एक्सरसाइज फोर्टीन पॉइंट वन यूनिट फोर्टीन जियोमेट्री पैरोलोग्राम यू कैन चेक दी प्ले लिस्ट ऑफ विमल सर्जी यूट्यूब चैनल हेयर इन द चैनल यू विल गेट योर क्लास नाइन एंड टेन सोल्यूशन ऑफ ऑप्शनल मैथ्स कंपलसरी मैथ्स साइंस एंड मेनी मोर भिडियोज which is necessary for you class 9 and 10 students to secure good marks in your SEE examination. So www.facebook.com slash b-i-m-a-l s-a-j-a-n is my Facebook ID or check the video description here there you will find my Facebook and TikTok ID. Follow me there so that whatever video I upload that video clip short clip you will get and that video will guide you to the full videos and then that you can watch in a full by going to this channel so if you haven't followed follow and don't forget to check the video description and also the playlist so this is the main video highlights in my youtube channel playlist bimal sarji 20 element bimal sarji 118 element bimal sarji short speech bimal sarji prime number bimal sarji province bimal sarji gk you can see at this side okay so type this word then you will get a video at the top of the YouTube videos and uh, once you read this uh, Bimal Saji 20 element or 180 element you will never forget because that uh, trick is made with uh, the Hindi and uh, Mathli and also Nepali uh, language of uh, funny dialogues okay funny dialogues is created and that dialogue will remind you that element for a long time so Keep watching and give a feedback okay there and now let me start the solution the question is 11d prove that the diagonals of a parallelogram divides it into two congruent triangles okay this is a parallelogram so given is what a b c d is a parallelogram this is a b parallel c d so if it is a parallelogram by this language we should know that if it is a parallelogram then a b is parallel to c d and also a b is equal to c d okay a b parallel to c d and a b equal to c d and also the uh, this opposite side also equal AC is equal to BD and AC is parallel to BD. So AC is parallel to both of them. And prove that the diagonal of parallelogram divide. So the diagonal means any one diagonal. Consider any one diagonal. If you take this diagonal also, then it will divide into two congruent triangle. But here to I we have to I will tie one, okay, one diagonal. So there is a one diagonal. So take this diagonal. So AD is the diagonal. Now we will prove that this diagonal divides this parallelogram into two congruent triangles that means this is congruent to this triangle okay so to prove here we can write in the language also that the uh, diagonal ad uh, divides a parallelogram into two congruent triangles so directly you can say to prove here triangle a b a b okay this is wrong way okay we have to write cyclic a b C and D, okay, write this cyclic name, okay, like this. So, now here, AB, angle ABC is congruent to triangle ACD. Triangle ACD, we have to prove this. Okay, if you prove this, then automatically you can show that this diagonal divides into two congruent triangles, okay, this is congruent to Now here, in one, in triangle A, B, C and triangle A, C, D. Number one, we we'll prove this congruent by side angle side of the See that if this is the parallelogram, then Obviously, this is parallel means this angle will be equal to this angle, alternate angle, yes. Got it? So, I'll write first this part, okay. Uh, so, this angle name is what? In this triangle, ABC. In this triangle, I will take this angle. So, this angle name is what? ACB, angle ACB. Angle ACB is equal to, this angle name is what? CAD, angle CAD. This is angle and the reason is what here? A B A D parallel B C. A D parallel B C. Okay, there is. 
Oh no. Change this, okay? Because I have changed the side. So what is there now? We have to change this part, okay? Here. Now we have to write here. Uh, A, B, parallel, C, D. A, B is equal to C, D. And A, D parallel, B, C. A, D, A, D parallel, B, C. And A, D is equal to B, C. Okay. And now there is the diagonal. What is the now diagonal here? Now our diagonal is A, C. Okay, A, C is the diagonal now. Okay. Now, A, D. So, A, D is parallel. A, D is parallel to B, C and and what? Alternate angle. This is called alternate angle. Alternate angles are equal. Okay. Now, number two, we have taken this angle. Now we'll take this side. AC is called AC. This side. In this triangle. This side and this triangle. This same side. Okay. That is common side. AC is equal to AC. That is, this is side. So, region is here what? Common side. Now, three numbers. We have taken this side. Now, this angle we have taken this side. So, now we can take this angle. So, this angle is equal to this angle. Why? Because this is AB is parallel to CD. Yes? And this is alternate angle, same region this. So we write here now, in this triangle, what do we write name? BAC. Angle BAC. Angle BAC. Why? Because we have taken first angle ABC. This triangle we have taken. So write that. Okay? Angle BAC. BAC is equal to angle. Now name of this what? ACD, angle ACD. The reason is what? The reason is here AB parallel CD. AB parallel, AB parallel CD. This is AB parallel BC, okay? And this is AB parallel CD or DC. Okay? DC or DC or AC. That is same. And alternate angles. Now, four number, okay, now we can write therefore, triangle ABC is congruent to triangle ACD, okay, ABC is congruent to ACD, why? By angle, sorry, angle side angle, by Angle side, angle side, angle axiom. Okay, this I have here angle. Okay, you see here angle. Okay, why this is angle? Okay, so right here by angle side, angle axiom. So this is proved here because now we prove that part that the triangle this is congruent. So this is what to prove here that this diagonal AC, okay, the diagonal AC of this parallelogram divided into two congruent triangles. So this is this is congruent to this, so this is okay, divides into this. Other way you can do this way also, okay, this, this way you can do, then in this way, you have to show what? You have to show, in this way you can show BCD, triangle is congruent to triangle ABD, okay, like that. So this is the complete solution. If you class 9 and 10 students like this video, then share with your friends, okay, comment, uh, okay, okay, give a sweet comment, and always, Okay, show your activeness by your sharing, okay, because what you share, what you like, okay, I can uh, see that in the, okay, there is the one, okay, apps that will help to know what is, okay, activities going on my YouTube channel, okay, so you are students, okay, uh, if you enjoy, if you feel helpful, okay, then give a short time, okay, to, uh, okay, to share with your friends also. Keep watching, keep supporting. See you in the next videos. Radhe Radhe. Jai Sri Krishna.